body. It's relaxing sounds going to you. And today I'm not really sure uh, how long I'm going to make this video. Um, I've been crazy busy so the last videos that came online were all pre-recorded quite some time ago so it's been maybe like two months since I've filmed anything which is crazy. And I actually still don't have a lot of time because I've said that I've been busy with university before but the last couple of weeks have been kind of extreme. <laughs> um, so I have actually a lot to talk about but I didn't want to make it a complete talking only video. So I thought while I'm talking about my experiences, I also thought of making some nice sounds. My nails don't look look very great. I hope that they do <laughs> do look nice on camera. But I didn't have much time to fix really pretty shiny nails. So I've done brushes and videos before. This is, well I've had this brush for a little while now, and it's a combination of plastic pins and uh, real animal hair. Don't worry, it's, uh, it's not based on animal cruelty or anything. Something is that I'm get, I had to get used to is there are no, like, pin, the, the pins don't have like little case, little, I don't know, on top of them, so it, on my, it doesn't feel too great on my head, so I just only push the ends where I go and put my head down so my hair is hanging. And it's a pretty gentle, it's pretty gentle on the hair, and animal hair is supposed to make your hair uh, really soft and shiny. But in my case, it actually makes it like real static sometimes. So I don't really know what's happening there. Last week was no ordinary week. I was on a sort of conference and it was a very cool, special kind of conference. And it, the name is a bit long, but I can look that up right here next to me. The, um, uh, it was a workshop week with lots of discussion and there were scientists of all kinds of fields economics, ICT, business, biology, um, artificial intelligence which is a I find really interesting and it was called an emerging technological and societal transition how do we prepare ourselves for the post-industrial world. And it's actually actually a topic that I would li really like to talk more about, but I'm afraid that videos like these aren't really <laughs> the best place for that, as I'm actually trying to make you sleepy and relax.
but it's a topic of great importance, I believe. And um, I was even asked by my teacher to give a small talk on a public event, which is a great opportunity. Um, and so I say yes, but it also completely terrifies me because I hate public speaking. I really, I really hate it. <laughs> didn't do as well as I had hoped. <laughs> so this is the first time in a while that I've actually recorded a video right before it was online. So I'm uploading on Monday. I'm filming this on the Sunday before and this workshop was just last week. So mostly most of the time when I talk about things that just happened to me, when you guys hear it, it's already been like a month ago because I pre-record so much. And I do this to be able to keep up a schedule. And I also do this because I know that there are times when I don't have the time or energy to film. And that has been the case for the past couple of weeks. So I'm really happy that I did record so much when I had the time. I have a pretty lights now and I also didn't send them up because it took too much time. I always have to build everything up and then break everything down because I do it in my bedroom. So there's a ways that it's not just filming, it's preparing, filming, taking everything down, editing, exporting, uploading. I am not complaining, it's just I didn't have time to do everything this this time. I realized that I didn't do any crinkly stuff in quite a while, so I brought some crinkly stuff. If you want to see more of this brush, let me know. I could maybe do a hairbrushing video again, maybe with this one. Can see. But I don't really know how well you guys can hear this. I can do a long hair brushing babbling video again if you like. crinkly. I have two types of crinkly. I have paper and plastic. I'm trying to figure out which... Okay. This is an envelope. And I hope that this is not coming off too harsh. Many people, when they film, they put their headphones in. I honestly find that really annoying to do. And even when I do that, I don't always hear everything that goes wrong because, I mean, I'm hearing it right in front of me as well, right? It's just gonna make the noises far away. <laughs> reason I was at the workshop was because I'm a uh, science communication student now. We were asked to report on this workshop, so there's actually a website and I've already, there are two short posts of me online over there. So I'll link that below and if you're interested you can take a look. The text is in Dutch, but there's a video with it that's English. I know 
notice I'm actually really in the mood to make more videos. But I don't know such time. Oh, it sucks. I'm working on um, I was really tired after this week. It was pretty intense. Many days of nine till six and um, the public event was on Thursday evening and I was nervous the entire day. I even slept uh, not very well the night before. And nerves take so much energy. I was so tired afterwards. started a Dutch vlog not too long ago and I haven't posted it on there for like two or three weeks from now and I really hope that, that won't happen but um, my days were so tiring that whenever I got home I was I had no energy you know how you just get on the couch and you just want like uh, to do passive stuff just watch a series or something not be creative even though that can be relaxing as well Do some other crinkly things. And I'm going to write a blog post today on some details on what I did this week be in Dutch, but I'll link that below as well.
I'm hearing my neighbors. There's so much noise. So I'm just crinkling as loud as I can. In the hopes that you won't hear it. Crinkly, it sounds a little bit different. It's a little bit higher, a little bit softer in a sense, I think. Thank you. 